I was faced with having to have to wear dentures. I was told by doctor after doctor that I would have to wear them. Then my sister told me about Dr. Henniger. And to my amazement, I was in denial that I could have permanent teeth. I wouldn't have to have dentures that I have to take in and out, in and out, possibly lose, have rubbish on my gums. This to me, not only could I get rid of the insecurity I had within, I could develop more or more of Heather and start coming out. Not only can I smile, not only do I eat popcorn now with a crunch, not only can I, for the first time, eat down on a, a cucumber, I now not only want to rebuild more relationships in my life, I no longer want to just uh, not be the withdrawn Heather. I now know there is more out there for me and I want others to know to pick up that phone because they can get the help like I did. My doctor said it's always telling me to eat fiber, but he didn't realize that I couldn't chew. If you can't chew, you can't eat, you, you know, broccoli or spinach or whatever it is, you can't chew it. If you can't chew it, it's no good. You can't eat it. But since I've had my implants, hey, I cannot believe that. I'm amazed. I'm able to chew everything, eat everything, and uh, I, I can't say how, how great it is. And I'm also a trumpet player, if that's important or not, but uh, I can play the trumpet. I've always been able to play pretty good. However, because my teeth were loose, I couldn't hit any high notes. But now my teeth are permanent and I can play as high as I want and I can practice as long as I want. I have more endurance. You know, it's just great. It, it, it's, it's great. It's great that you can do all these things that you never were able to do just because of teeth. I, I tend to want to smile more because you know, my, my smiles improve drastically um, and my ability to chew food is, you know, I don't have any issues with that anymore. So I was missing a few teeth. You couldn't see a lot of the teeth that I was missing. So my smile wasn't affected as much, but you could tell that, you know, I needed some dental work. So now I kind of feel like I'm 20 years old again, except for the gray hair. These are like my real teeth. These are uh, exactly actually what my teeth used to look like. I brought in a picture, Randy, of what my teeth used to look like. These are exactly now what my teeth used to look like. I don't have the chipped away teeth that I laid at night thinking, what am I going to do? I now have a smile, a bite, a confidence I never had before. People say I have a beautiful smile and I feel better and I look better. The procedure was not painful because they gave me sedation therapy and so when they put me to sleep when I woke up I had beautiful teeth. I, I stopped smiling and that affected my family, that affected me, that affected uh, all of us around, everyone around us. I now can go out for job searching. I now can go out and smile in the grocery store. I now can just, I can now continue to say hi to people like I was once doing before. And now, with these dental implants, I can say hi, and I can spread that hello. And I want others to know, for them, to just pick up that phone, because they can get the help that I now got. I'm 70 years old. By the time I was 30, I'd had my nose and my jaw broken seven or eight times. Most of the teeth broken off or knocked out. I went all the way to age 69 before it finally came to the conclusion that I needed to deal with the whole process. For the first time in over 35 years, I can eat practically anything and I don't worry about pain, which was a big issue before because without an upper jaw ridge, no appliance can fit and no amounts of any of the goopy stuff will make it stay in. So once we rebuilt the jaw, once we put the implants in, I actually can eat like anybody else. You know, if you have a dentist that you go to, ask him about implants because implants work. It, it's just incredible how all of a sudden, just with two, and all, all I have is two implants in the bottom. And my teeth are solid. And I'm a trumpet player. And I eat anything that I want. In fact, I'm able to diet now. 
because I could eat broccoli, I could eat corn on the cob, I could eat stuff that I was never able to eat before, stuff that is healthy for you. It's great. So don't walk to your dentist, run. I went to the dentist a lot when I was a kid and I stopped going um, as I became an adult just because of the you know, fear of going to the dentist. I didn't really want to and you know after being with Dr. Henniger and his staff you know they make you feel really comfortable so I had no reservations about going back regardless of the extensive work I was having done you know I felt like I was at home so it was a real comfortable situation and uh, you know I didn't have those butterflies before I went in it was kind of like just going to work really. Absolutely no more dentures. I got teeth. I got my first compliment the other day. I get compliments now. No more dentures. Dr. Henniger is a very personable doctor, very compassionate. He did IV sedation, something other doctors will not do on me because of my autoimmune elements. He does, I went in with the, with the IV sedation, he woke up with teeth. And it was the most wonderful experience where I couldn't even say wonderful. Now I can say wonderful because it was a personable, comfortable, more than I can even say. Maybe I can just show you. <laughs> After well over two or three hundred dental office visits in my life, many, again, broken jaws, pretty painful experiences, to rebuild this jaw do the eight implants, get the entire process fit, was completely painless. And I'll bring a new word in, pleasant. Never in my life has pleasant been associated with a dental office, but in this case, it was done, and it was done efficiently, effectively, and pleasantly. You know, anything you have done is, is to, to a point, discomforting, but painful, no. You know, they, they do everything they can to make sure you're comforted. So I, you know, they, could, they couldn't do a better job at that. Everything they do is, you know, your comfort and your pain level are real important to them. So it's, that's a good thing. Let me tell you about Dr. Gunadar. This guy is really, really concerned. He's always smiling. He's always happy. And he tell, explains everything step by step. And one of the things, he told me I would have a little bit of pain, but he was wrong. I have no pain. It's perfect. When I saw my smile for the first time, I was no longer looking in the mirror at someone that was crouching down. When I first saw that smile, I could stand up, I could smile, start doing my hair again, start putting makeup on again, start uh, talking on the phone more again, start walking out with the dog more outside more. Everything in life changed for the positive towards the good just because of a smile, because of teeth, because someone was there to help me. Someone was and someone was there and someone will be there for you also.